Hello, my name is Andrew Howell. I'm here doing a video review for the Red Star DSLR Folding Shoulder Rig. This shoulder rig comes with a matte box, follow focus unit, and the base shoulder rig. As for the base shoulder unit here, it's extremely versatile. You can either mount it on your shoulder and run it like that, or you can fold your handles up and fold the actual shoulder part here all the way down underneath the rig. like so, and run it like that, just go two-handed out like that, you can get some really nice smooth movements there, or you can unfold your long handle here. The other thing that's really nice is this back right here will also telescope, it's not just a standard handle, you can get it about, we'll say, eight inches higher than what it would be normally. You can fold this guy out here and as long as you get these really tight, these are uh, these nuts are really hard to tighten down all the way. But once you get it really nice and tight here, you could run it like this back and forth. If you really cranked it down, you could grab it by this, but what I've noticed is it likes to, even when you get it tight, it likes to unfold there. I imagine if you got some really nice locking nuts on here rather than these, uh, these are a little bit harder to turn, but I imagine if you got like a wing nut on there, you could really crank it down and use this uh, handle a lot easier. All of these handles have quarter inch screw holes on the tops and the bottoms, so you can it, mount a light, you can mount your uh, LCD screen right up to these guys. Or you can flip them down like this, and you also have mounting screws right there too. Uh, so extremely versatile. You can add any accessory you can think of uh, onto any of these. Your follow focus unit here is uh, very smooth, very easy to use. They've added these two nice blue locking pins here that you can move. You can set your first point of focus, and then. Uh, set this locking pin, tighten it down, now it's not going to go any further than that. Same thing with your second point of focus, you can set a second point of focus there. Now you can just snap between both of them if you have two different subjects you'd like to switch back and forth between, this is definitely the way to do it. The other thing this kit comes with is this uh, follow focus bracket here. Uh, it's so you can mount your follow focus unit directly to the bottom of your camera, it's tripod mount. Uh, so you can use your follow focus independently of the mat box and the shoulder rig. Uh, to attach this to your follow focus unit here, what you need to do is, on the rails here, there's this wing nut there. Go ahead and remove that. Now you can take your rail mount here and insert the bracket through the slot in the rail mount. Make it so you can see through there. So grab your follow focus unit. Now insert the screw through the hole there. Now all you have to do is reattach your washer and your nut. Alright, and then you're ready to go. Just go ahead and mount this to your bottom of your camera there, and then adjust your follow focus as needed, and then there's your independent follow focus unit. In conclusion, this folding shoulder rig here is a must-have for anybody shooting DSLR video. Uh, it is extremely versatile. You can modify it to fit any situation. Uh, and it comes with a map box and follow focus. Can't get much better than that. Uh, the greatest advantage for me and for a lot of you out there is going to be that I can use my Canon battery pack on the bottom now. I wasn't able to do that with previous kits because they wouldn't fit quite in there. Uh, and now I can use my battery pack and my T3i with the follow focus and the map box attached to it. I wasn't able to do that with their previous kit, but that's a great thing that they've uh, modified it just enough so that you can attach it there. It's a very tight fit, but it works well. Uh, the only two disadvantages to the kit are uh, I have a 77mm lens here, but it's not going to fit through the back of the matte box. Uh, but if you want to use your 77mm lens, all you have to do is mount the lens through the matte box. This used to be an issue on the previous kit because uh, you couldn't use your battery pack, so every time you'd have to change your battery, you'd have to remove your lens and then remove the camera, replace the battery, put the camera back on, put the lens back in. Now you don't have to do that. It's uh, perfect. The other minor disadvantage is that these nuts here will not really crank down quite as tight as I could need. Uh, 
a wing nut or something like that would work a lot better. You could replace it if you'd like to. And that concludes this video review of the Red Star DSLR Folding Shoulder Rig. Go ahead and add it to your cart. It's an exceptional piece of equipment.